Hey everyone, Modern Warfare 3 is here, and along with the multiplayer is their new Zombies mode. Now, I actually have never really played too much Zombies in the past, have dabbled with it here and there, but with this kind of new DMZ-like structure, this really intrigued me. So, figured I would give this a shot, see how much I enjoy it. I've got my operator all set up bringing in shotgun and a launcher because I'm just going to try and level through weapons as well. I want to just max out all the weapons along with completing the story mission. So we're going to just start working through these here. And I also am going to work on the daily challenges. So let's get into it. Um, it's kind of a bummer that unlike DMZ you can't pick three missions but from what I've been hearing they kind of auto fill so I'm hoping maybe after I complete the first one the second one I think is run over so many uh, zombies with a vehicle so we'll hopefully work towards that as well all right Hello, world. So let's see Card here. Team, Dobbs. Let's test your tactical map oh. skills. Getting a contract. Once you complete it, call in a helo and get the hell out. Okay. So you can actively see where all the other teams are. Interesting. I mean, I know there's no PvP, so. Let's get him. Did you see that? Your target dropped an ammo pouch. Like so, automatically refill your weapons. Some of the EZ's inhabitants take a lot of killing. Anything that keeps you putting lead on target is a good thing. Okay, so let's ping a contract. What's this? Ether nest? Okay. How do you ping? Oh, A? Marking contract! That's interesting. Oops. Uh, I didn't want to invite. Okay, backpack just like DMZ. Let's get that. Oh boy. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was brutal. I don't know right now what the... That one's like a fancy purified water. Eventually I'll figure out what all the... You know... How important is it to hold on to and sell things? Oh, did that contract go away? No, it didn't. Okay. Marking contract. Oh, it didn't. Ping. Ping a contract in the tag map. I did that. It's not showing as checked though. I did hear there's quite a few bugs in here already. I don't know why I stowed that. Okay, so locate the bounty. Bounty's this way. So now it's time. Go real loud. Plus. You are about to meet one of Hugo's most wanted. Nice welcome, will you? Ooh, he's a strong one. Here we 
that player, please? Ooh, someone's down. Oh, he is, yes, very strong. Oh, I thought that was open. Entry loading. Probably gonna waste all my ammo on this guy. Really careful now. Ooh. Okay, it's fine. Oh. Okay. Um. This is fairly brutal. Get up here. Ah! Oh! Oh! That was stupid of me. That's right, I have. Oh gosh. I have these things. Brain rot. Uh, I don't know what brain rot does and I don't know what I just did. All right, is this thing still up over here? I'd love to pick up whatever that was. I also just need armor. Okay, it's not there anymore. Oh! Ah! Hey! Got him with brain rot. All right. Okay, so... Reward rift. Death perception can. Brain rot ammo. Oh, I need that. It will enhance your combat abilities. If you want to survive your time in the EZ, load up on perks. You will find the combination that works best for you. Okay, drink to gain. Obscured enemies, chest resources, and item drops are key lined. No idea what that means. Um, and... Oh, it did... Wait. Complete a contract. Okay. Interesting. Well, I guess I do need to exfil, and the only reason I say that is because if they all, if the next mission only tracks after the first one is completed, then I have to exfil. But what I'm gonna do is take a car over there. And see if running zombies over maybe tracks that in the back end. Zombie vehicle kill, so let's see if we can kind of count. That's one. I think if I just head along this road, I'll make it there. Bink, bink. Bink, bink. 
Oh no, it's open supply chests. That's what I think the second objective is. Open supply chests. So I guess I should go check some supply chests and see if those get triggered. Oh boy. I don't think I can drive through this. Okay, so let's see. Let me check though crates. Let me just check around here really quick. See if there's any crates I can open. Let's open just one to see if it tracks. Of course, I guess I can also just check the vehicle one because that one is a little bit later on. Mark to pack a punch. Okay, do I want to go see that? Pack a punch, pack a punch, pack a punch. Oh, right there. Okay, so let's try this out. Heard pack a punching a weapon is a good thing. There's one container. Let's ping this. Maybe it will say what level it's on. Yep, there we go. Okay, how do I do this? So, perk just pack a punch level one, increase damage and ammo capacity for Lockwood. Five thousand. Okay, cool. So let me go call in this exfil and let me just go hog wild with the grenade launcher. Because it says it's supposed to spawn a bunch of AI. Kite some here, Let's see if I can get them to kind of group up. Yeah, that's it. I'm almost there. Still don't know what full power does. Whoop. And I'm assuming the helicopter is like 68, okay. Thanks, hey, zombie hey, rot. Bravo, okay, Zulu. there we go. Dope. All right, well, there we go. So there's Modern Warfare 3 Zombies. First infill, exfill. Let's check the missions. I wonder if... So I got that one done. Yeah, okay, so... Looks like they don't kind of auto populate, which is a bummer. Um, I wish they would. Or that you could pick three like you could in DMZ. So you can kind of be working towards multiple at once. But that's okay. Uh, DMZ was in a very bare bones state when it first launched. Now, granted, you would think they, they would learn from that, but I'm not going to gripe too much. So yeah, there we go. Hope you all enjoyed the content. Uh, keep a lookout for more videos. Thanks. Bye.